Okay guys, welcome back to the Kingdom Hearts 3 Let's Play Part 4. Now, as we last left off, everyone had their goals, they're going to Radiant Garden, we're trying to find Roxas, and right now, we're at the world map, so we're about to get in this right now. Now, I can tell you right now, right, right now, I'm gonna give this out straight up. This is hands down the best gummy world or just gummy ship playable open world area period because in the past games it was more linear we had to follow a set route that they, that they give us basically and dude i'll just show you what i mean like, look at this the gummy ship battles in this no 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 this is the best one hands down hands to the down this is amazing and as you can see here also with the camera i also don't have my glasses i'm wearing my contacts so if i do look kind of weird uh that's why my eyes look like this so yeah sorry about that if you feel sorry about that, but like, or I don't know, I'm saying about that for whatever reason, but like, look! Look at all this! Like, it's so huge! You can do. Like, dude! There's so much in this! There's so much in this! I love it so much! I really, really do! I really do! This is a thousand times more enjoyable in terms of the gummy ship sections. This is hands down the best gummy ship gameplay exploration out of all of them. Because in the past games, it wasn't even exploration, it was more just the world map. You get to go to where you want to go to, you activate the gummy ship section in gameplay, and it was more linear, it wasn't really that fun. No, I love this. I literally love this. I'm not even gonna lie. I I I, I actually love it. I actually love it. I'm tripping up I, I'm tripping up on my words because of how much I love it. And I won't tell you why, I'll show you guys, like, just so much. So much. And as we can see here, it's huge! You can go in any direction you want. You can see all of this, like, all at once. It, it's so much. And by the way, we do have to actually go to the world also, so I'm not gonna harp too much and talk too much on this place and how amazing it, you know, it is. But it's like... Just look, you can go in between the rocks! You can see different parts of the open, yo, know, space place in the world map. It's like, dang it, dude. And as we can see here, we're here. There's so much. And you know what? Before I even go there, I'm gonna show you a tab. Like, as you can see with the icons, it shows where the Heartless are at, the stars represent the, you know, the difficulty, and all of this. You can go into all of this. It's crazy! It, it's so crazy to me. It's so crazy to me. Like, it's like, dang, dude. Like, Namura, what are you on, man? Again, like, so many aspects about this, like, so many aspects about this game I love. I love so much. I'm tripping up on my own words because of how good they are. It's like, dang it, man. I'm not saying the game is perfect, but it, it, it's like, Dang, dude, what are you on, Namura? What are you on? It, it's so crazy. Man, I love it. I love it. Now, in the actual gameplays here, it, it, it is a tad bit more linear, but it's linear because it kind of needs to be in, in this part, but in terms of, like, going about the world and, you know, still attacking things that you can still attack while you're in your more open exploration type of areas, then you can do it like that, but, like, in, in terms of, like, gameplay like this, it does have to be, like, a tad bit more linear in terms of like how you fight enemies and how they come about but still it's like this is hands down my favorite gummy ship sections in terms of any kingdom hearts game period which technically is only like kingdom hearts 1 kingdom hearts 2 but it's like dang i don't know i don't know well actually no i take that back i do know i love it Should have got rank A, but you know, I was talking a bunch, so that's kind of why. But it's like, yeah, like, and get you can still attack people here too, right? Yeah, you know, attack people. You can go about. No, no, this is hands down, hands down, my favorite gummy ship gameplay in any Kingdom Hearts game. Period. Which again, technically, is only Kingdom Hearts one, Kingdom Hearts two. But it's like, dang it, dude, just dang, man. I just cannot take this, like... And you can see the world! It's not like, oh, you're in the world map and you go to the world in the world map. It's like you literally see the world in, like, a big 
planet type spear. It's like, no, no. Oh, in the apps. I forget. We have Instagram. I freaking love how that's in the loading screens for Kingdom Hearts 3. I said this earlier in, I think, part one, but dude, yeah. It's great. And we have the hashtags, and they're in the shape of like a heart. So it's like hashtag C, hashtag C. Oh no, hashtag sky, hashtag C, hashtag where hearts return, man. Oh man, no, I love it. I love it. I love it so much. Again, aspects in this game, so many I just love so much compared to any other game we have ever had in the Kingdom Hearts series, but, man. But, dude, look at that. The clock tower. Now, again, it's not perfect. There are gripes I do have that are legitimate gripes, I personally feel like, but at the same time, it's still kind of like, wow. Gorge, we forgot to fill Master Yen Sid in on what happened. Should we go back? Hmm. You mean about Maleficent and Zigbar? No. The others have already got enough on their plates as it is. Why go stressing I mean, them out? Yen Sid really the three has of us nothing. know how to handle so a couple right. of old adversaries, right? Yeah, I guess. But guess. doesn't that thing Pete said bother you? The black box? Come on, we're talking about Pete. So I do that really... means it's probably no big deal. Oh, I don't know. Oh, cool. The trams are still here. I mean, why would they leave? Yeah, it really has Feels like it. Like... Maybe you're feeling what Roxas feels because he misses home. But Roxas mm -hmm. was in, Roxas was in Actually, Sora this whole time, so it's kind of like... I ran into Roxas in the sleeping world. He's been there for like... Well, it was like... Seeing into his heart for the first time. Uh huh. It was a test to see if your data version was ready to face the hurt that you carry inside. Was I ready? This is one of those scenes here where I it's like you her. need to play the past games to understand what when they I mean by Riku this. And, so it's Kairi, like... and later, when I lost the Keyblade. And you guys had to go on without me like that? Yeah, they sucked back then. Like... Having no one to turn to was the worst kind of hurt. But that just shows how much you mean to me. Because Carrying they turned their backs a little on hurt you? Can't be all kinda that weird. I get what he means, but it's caring. still kinda like... Recoding, you know. Of course! See that game? Any Sora's still Sora. So wait! If Roxas feels something, then we're in the right place. Roxas, I'm gonna find you. You saying that to Donald and Goofy? That's more of like a statement you're making to yourself. It's huh? kinda like Oh, but here we go. Right, Nobody! Oh, dude, here we go. Links. Oh, here we go. Look at this! Like, again, I'm not saying this world's perfect. There are definitely complaints and gripes I have about it, but it's like, the things we do see still look so good to me. Just, dang, man. Dang. Here we go. I'll do links in like a second. Let me get Ars Arcanum. Yeah. 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 Man, so cool. Let's keep going. Woo! Gotcha. Man, I love this. I love it. Get finishing, let's do it. Dude, they're all here, all the, the dream eaters. Yeah. 
Let's yeah. change up key points also. Again, DLC exclusive if you pre-order the game or if you pre-order the PS4 Pro Limited Edition Kingdom Hearts 3 Edition, which I did, that's how I got it. And yeah, it's cool. Hmm. What was that voice? I know I heard it. I didn't hear it. You sure it wasn't the wind? Or something else? I'm pretty sure. Where'd they come huh? from? Get the ice cream later. Huh? <laughs> what? Hold up. See? Voices. New ones? I think so. What? Painter? Pens? Olette! And we got more of the demon wave. Oh, what is that? So, first nobody's now heartless. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Hey, Sora! Hello, goodbye! Oh. Man, get go. back here and help fight. We got this. No, we don't. We need all the help we can get. It's like freaking three against like a thousand. HE graphics looks so good! Dang it! I can't help but bring that back up! Oh my gosh, man! Again, world, it's not perfect! Definitely complaints, but it's like... The things we do see! So it's like, it, it still looks so good! Dang it! Dude, oh my gosh, man! Oh wait, 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 no, 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 wrong way, wrong. There we go. And he's gone again. Okay, let's do it. I'm not gonna open that up yet. I'm gonna wait till I beat this boss. And the sunset on the. Mmm, dang it. Man, dang it. Actually doing something for once in this game. Right. Okay, okay, come on. Where are you going? Where are you going? Change my keyblade up again to the hero's origin. Let's do it. No, 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 no. Get back here, get back here, get back here. Man, he's still not down here. There we go. Let's do it. Counter shield, let's do it. Mm, let's go in. It's over. Yo, yo, wait, wait a second. Go. We got cure and MP safety. And again, I'm insanely glad I got the PS4 Pro, so I got that clean 60 FPS, even though technically it's not exact 60 FPS, there are times where it goes down and dips at like 50, but still. Nice I'm assuming fighting. on PS4 Thanks, on the Sora. standard to be lower, Painter, so Pence, OLED. yeah. It's been ages. What? It hasn't been that long. Yeah, not really, no. Yes, Donald, Goofy, how are ya? We're good. Howdy there, Olette. So does this mean that weird stuff's going down again? You kidding, uh. Pence? 
When have we ever seen a tornado of shadowy blobs before? Yeah. It's not weird. This is unprecedented. I mean, very hmm. detailed word to use, is. but yeah. The creatures from yeah. the last time were bright white. These things must be new. Man, I can't wait to get to sleuthing. Sleuthing? We're already done with the school project, silly. Whatever's going on, you wouldn't be here unless you had a good reason. True, true. Which yeah. is? Well, actually, we're looking for Roxas. Roxas? That's funny. I don't know any Roxas, mm. but the name sounds familiar. Maybe we bumped into him somewhere. Again, it's kind of like... How does that make sense entirely in terms of like how they would feel? Actually, he the might have been friends with Roxas? another version of you. Hmm? This photograph. Yeah, we've got the same one. Oh, yeah, the other Twilight Town. Yeah. It's like one of those spot the differences puzzles, except really easy. I guess in that town, we're friends with this Roxas person. Sora, let us help you track Roxas down. <laughs> really? Okay. Sure, he seems like a pretty cool guy. I mean, photos can be deceiving. It's kind of <laughs> yeah, like... Yeah, he is. Mm, Great, you know. then let's hey, all for all you know, he could be an insane if stalker psychopath. Knew Roxas, you never maybe know. Then maybe alternate other folks did too. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Sora, you three should go to the place in the photo. It's the old mansion. The three of us will cover places in town. Thanks. Oh, yeah. I got this phone thingy that takes phone pictures. Phone thingy. <laughs> Want to snap a photo while we're all here? Sure. Now, where's That's the lens on the back of the phone? It's kind of like... <laughs> okay. <laughs> I love this scene. Mm? I love it. Not gonna lie. Wait, who's taking it? <laughs> yeah, it's like, who's taking it? Oh. Like... Mm. <laughs> I love that. Uh, why do I have to do it? Hey, tough luck. You drew the short straw. Yeah, It's yeah. okay. Oh, I'm sitting out of the photo with you, Donald. Can you take the photograph? Man. <laughs> Yo, Donald, man, stop being salty. Come on. Everybody smile. <coughs> Is that like a timer? Oh. Wow. That came out great. Donald looks ticked oh, off, though. A man. lucky emblem. Lucky emblem? Oh, yeah. They are huge right now. Supposedly, these things are hidden all over town. Disney. And really? if you get a picture of them, they'll Wait, bring you good luck. I'm about to talk about this in like a second. Cool. Wait, look guys, is that... Uh, you're right. Oh, I see you too. <laughs> I knew it. Good luck, because they're not all this easy to find. Okay. Really? We better Disney. start asking around. Disney. You start by checking out the old mansion. Dude, wait. We'll catch up. Got it. Okay, so it's like hidden Mickeys are now in Kingdom Hearts 2. So basically, right, at Disneyland, Disney World, they have hidden Mickeys where they're like scattered all over there. And people call them subliminal Mickeys, hidden Mickeys. Now they're doing it in Kingdom Hearts 2. It's like, Disney, what are you trying to do? And again, this brings me back to another YouTuber called Swoozy where he talked about that once too. And it's... Dude, I don't know. Like, Disney, what are you trying to do? Like, he did Mickey's. But oh, dude, I love this. Taking the selfies. Hey, you get AP boost. Cool. I'll help you find the next one. And by the way, I we can store our Keyblade transformations, so we can go back to it later on. I, I, I dude, so much detail, so much detail. But here, let's see. Before I keep going, let me grab some stuff. Well. Do I want it? Mm, you know what? No, no. For now, I'm going to leave it and not do anything with it. Because I don't think I need it as of right now. I will upgrade later on. But for right now, I want to keep it like this. I'm going to go to Air Combo Plus and I'm all out. Crap, okay. Let's 
about it. That's about it. Yeah. And we have cure. So, and you know what? I'm going to set fire to X. It's much, much easier for me to do it if I have it set to there. Alright. Yeah, so cure goes to circle, fire goes to water. There we go. And yeah, there we go. For now, we should be good. Now, let me open this chest up also, because yeah. I know it has the map in there, so. Now, and here. So Hainer and Pence and I are friends in the other Twilight Town. I'm not surprised. Okay, but now, gripes, I don't want to keep... It's like, man, every time I'm doing this, there are things I want to say that it's like I don't want to say it. Because so many things in this game, like I said before, is so amazing, so grand, so fantastic. It's like crap, but at the same time, there are things in the game where it's like they upset me. And I don't want to say what they are, because again, video. I will make a video. <laughs> Either that or... If I ever live stream this game on Twitch, I will say everything I feel about how I feel about the game on Twitch. So, yeah. Let's see here, though. You can do it. Now, for the record, I did not play any of the classic Kingdom games in my first playthrough of Kingdom Hearts. Main reason being is because I played them all on my actual phone in Unchained Key or Union Key. And, I don't know, I don't know. I'll play them at some point. I won't play them in this Let's Play just because I feel like there's no point. I'm playing the main story, so it's like, yeah. Here, yeah, let's see. And now they changed up. So, in this area here, I'm assuming you go through this door back in Kingdom, in Kingdom Hearts 2. You go through the door here, and that leads you into the other part of Twilight Town. But as we can see here, it doesn't. It's more blocked off, and it's kind of like... Okay, so I'm assuming it's blocked off. And I don't know. In terms of that, I'll say I don't like how that's blocked off. Yeah, man, we have to. Okay, let's see here. Heartless and Blaze, let's take care of them. Nah, no, we don't, Donald. Oh. Right now, dude, like, it's always shadows. Come on. Sometimes you legit overreact a tad bit. Man, shut the heck up. I'll go as fast as I freaking want, man. You can't tell me what to do. I tell you what to do. Here we go. And by the way, I love this Keyblade. I really do. I really do love this Keyblade. Now, I know for the Xbox, they also made their own version of this Keyblade called... I think Twilight something, if I'm correct? And it looks okay, but I love this one way more. When you hit people or Heartless or Nobodies, uh, you see the symbols for the PS4 controller appear out of the Keyblade, and that's super cool. Yo, the wood, so... Now, one thing I did notice also is that uh, back in the old trailers, it showed the wall that had the hole in it. It showed the wall patched up from the inside, from the woods being patched up from the inside of the woods. Now, in the final cut of this game, they just got rid of that completely. It's just a big wall here. That's kind of interesting. So, it made me kind of assume that maybe they had an original story idea for how they were going to do that. But now it's mostly gone, because, you know, that whole wall, whole thing is gone, so it's like, yeah. What's that? Ah, Monkey, you know, Monkey Heartless, what do you think that I don't know the name of. To? I used to, but... Hmm. Yo, Remy! Look! On that branch! The Heartless have him surrounded! Oh no! What's up? Yeah! Okay, let's go, let's go! Hey! On the event! Let's do it! Woo! We're about to kill Remy with all this water everywhere, but still, woo! Nah. Let's see here. Tree some. Here. 
to make like a big splash like everywhere since you Now, I don't want to use these events too much just because it makes it a tad bit too easy to do things in the game. In terms of, like, fighting. Yes, they're not making it easy for us. Right, and, you know, they're monkeys, so... And again, the exact name for these monkey-type artlets, I'm forgetting. I used to know their names, but I'm forgetting, though. Now, I did wish Second Form M had a different color to them, so, so like, in terms of, like, you know, Second Form, it looks like, you know, the black, typical King Hearts suit clothing, but in Second Form M, maybe it had, like, yellow, or, or, no, Second Form M, it had, like, you know, Sora's iconic King of Hearts 1 clothing, that could have been cool, but it's still the same, you know, black, or, you know, black clothing that he had. Let's do it. Combo team attack. Okay. See one more. Oh, they. Ruby always has to freaking take my spotlight. Come on. I know I take the spotlight like you know all the time, but in terms of me, well, not Sora. Take me. care. <laughs> I want the spotlight. Yep, let's see though. Do I love do I love how Remy is in this game? Yo, Whoa, I love what, that. What is what, 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 what. I love that Monkey. dude, I'm not gonna lie. That little fella's parked on your head. Huh? Would you cut that up? Whoa! Dang. Huh? About yeah. You no, know, maybe he wants you to pick up the fruit for him. Mm, okay, that's fine, but I can do it by myself. I just need to collect the fruit. Right then. So, what are you going to do with all this, anyway? Huh? Hmm? Oh. Well, okay. You be careful going now, home. Now, question. How is he going to pick all of that up See and you take around. it back with him? It's like, it's huge. Carrying one alone would be too much for him. It's like... See, it's one thing to pick up the fruit. But, you know, you kind of have to help him take it back to where he has to go. It's like, again, like, he can't even carry one by himself. Like, one's bigger than him. And another question in terms of the lore of the world. Now, granted, you know, Remy's from another world, but it's like... You know, Remy's a rat, right? Mickey's a mouse. How is Remy smaller than him, not talking like, you know, Mickey does? Or have, like, humanistic characteristics... Yeah, now I know another world, but I'm just saying, kind of weird, kind of weird. And again, yo, really doing the gameplay here. I'm so really, really happy I played this game on Proud as my first playthrough of the game because, dude, I'll say this outright, it's very, very easy. Aside from playing Proud. Now, I wish Critical was in the game, for some reason it's not, it's super weird, but yeah, I, I wish it was, but still, it's weird. Oh, dude, I, I gotcha, I gotcha. Oh, dang it! I'm thinking that's a freaking fire place! Dude, wait. I got this, I got this. I messed up once, I'm not gonna mess up again. I saw a chest somewhere, so let me grab that also. It should be like yeah. right here. Yeah, yeah, I see. Yeah. Oops, I did not mean to do that. Yeah. I actually did not mean to do that, but 
So, you know, I have to level up anyway. So it's like, yeah. Now, one thing about this game is that there's slow motion in the game, right? I hardly ever see myself actually using slow motion. Like, like, the real. I really feel like I hardly ever see myself using flow motion at all in this game. Reason being is that there are so many other ways you can fight that's honestly kind of better than flow motion. So it's like, yeah, yeah. I see it. That and no loading screens. No loading screens. This is one big area from Twilight Town all the way to up to here. It's one big map, dude. Like what? That's nuts! Oh my... Yeah. No, I love it. I love it. I love it so much. It's not even funny. It's not, man. It's so not funny. Let me grab this. I know, Donald. I mean, why do you think we're here? Yo, Namine's room. Namine's room, oh my gosh, man. <sighs> Roxy's, no, oh, man. <sighs> What do you think, guys? This place is even creepier than I remember. Not really. I actually well, think it looks really cool. say that this mansion is haunted. Really? I honestly think it looks even better now. Like, it looks so mm -hmm. tranquil and peaceful and just loving. Like, and with the sunset in the background, it's like, hey yeah. There. <gasps> Dang, man. <sighs> Thanks for the heart attack. It's not even oh, creepy. What? It's really Did not. I like, scare you? It looks very uh, tranquil uh, and peaceful. <laughs> Are bad. So how did it go? Did you get any leads? <laughs> nope. Afraid not. The asking around thing was a total bust. Yep. This old mansion is our last hope. You guys ready? I see. I would love Another to learn about the, lore about the mansion. Because we really don't know the lore of who built the yeah. mansion, why, who lived in it originally, aside from Diz, Nominee, and Sora for the time being back then, but... Yeah, like... Because we really know nothing about that mansion. Make sure my phone's okay, too. Yeah, it's fine. Here we go! The password was, uh, sea salt ice cream, right? Okay, Wait, I'm account in. Pence? So, Let's like, what, he made his, like, own account? Working. Then? Uh, uh, oh, man. The transporter's been protected. Protected from what? I guess from us? We can't use it to get to the other Twilight Town. Why not? It worked before. We sent Sora there. Well, that was then. And this is now. That's not an explanation, no dude. Way? Come on. None that I know. I mean, it hasn't even been that long Great. ago. Why is it now we can't go there? Uh, huh? Man, I love that. Dude. We're gonna Hello, get that Sora. ringtone. Not gonna lie. You wouldn't happen to be in front of a computer. Huh? Enzo. Well, yeah. But how'd you know that? I was tinkering with Ansem's computer. You know, to decrypt the code that was left in it. And I noticed that someone had logged in from another terminal. I figured it might be you. Uh, oh, yeah, the log terminal. Man. You don't know any shit. Man. Oh, and what? You do? 
<laughs> I know. Oh, I haven't got a clue. Trying to figure out. <laughs> hey, Goofy's being honest. When, uh, hey, I respect that, man. Who was it that logged in? Oh, hi there. This is Pence. I'm the one who logged into the computer. Good. As long as it's a user that we know we can trust. Yup. But I'm kind of stuck here. Hmm. One of the programs is protected, so I can't uh, run it. Which program? Uh, the transporter to the other Twilight Town. Uh, it's the only way to find Roxas. You gotta help us. Okay. Another Twilight Town? And a transporter? Okay. A virtual town inside the computer made of data. A datascape? Fellas! Mm-hmm. We've seen one. That's what we used once to investigate Jiminy's journal. Yeah. Again, Maybe back in Recoded, play something. the game. So it's like... Pence, let's get a network set up. My address here is... He can actually sleep while I'm standing. Wow. Okay, sharing is enabled. <gasps> huh? Were you able to fix it? Now that our two computers have been successfully networked together, I can take control of the terminal there and change the privileges. Okay. okay. And Roxas? Yes. For the virtual world to be completely realized, Ansem the Wise would have included Roxas's full data in the construction. Meaning, somewhere on your machine, there's a log of that data that, uh, basically, we can decipher Ansem's code more quickly, and okay. we can analyze the virtual Twilight Town while we're at it. Okay, okay, okay cool. Great. Dude, I love I how when they do FaceTime, so it looks like how it normally would look in FaceTime, where Glad it's like, it's not high-quality 1080p, 60fps, we'll it's it. like, Chippendale I love it. helping me out here on this end. I'll call you back as soon as we know anything more. Thanks. Oh, before I forget, a bit of troubling news. It's about one of the organization's former members. You knew him as Vexen. But to us, he was Ansem's apprentice, Evan. Okay, yeah. He was recompleted like the rest of us. But hadn't regained consciousness yet. Yeah. Then, sometime after Lee left, Evan vanished. Dum, dum, dum. and Dylan, the two you knew as Lexius and Zaldin, they went out looking for him, but he's just gone. And I'm starting to worry. Now, one thing I am kind of curious you think on he's is that, on their uh, side? I think it's a real possibility. I'll say this in like a second. He's a devious researcher. You should be careful. All right. Thanks. Oh no, we got work. I totally forgot. Really? But what about all this? Hey, both are important. We're gonna need some cash to go to the beach. Also, don't forget the pretzels. Gotta buy four now. Yo, pretzels are not mm -hmm. even that good. Uh, Yo, for Roxas. Oh, I get it. He's thinking ahead. <laughs> hey, true, true. Later, Sora. Yeah, Using see the you brain. later. Bye, Donald. Goofy. Goodbye. <laughs> Oh, and since I'm manning the computer here, you guys are in charge of earning my share. No pretzel for pence. <laughs> hey. <sighs> but yeah, anyway, though, basically, in terms of what I was saying earlier... In terms of the organization members coming back, some of them, it's like, they're good again, but why? Because, like, as we know, some do want to repent, like, uh, like, uh, Ienzo. As he, like, I was about to butcher the name. But, like, other people, like Alias and Dylan, they were bad people. Like, Kingdom Hearts 1, Chain of Memories, they were legit bad people. And, you know, like, uh, and again, I'm gonna mix up the names. I'm sorry. If I'm saying this right, the black haired dude that had all the spears, Dylan, if I'm saying his name right, I'm sorry. Uh, he was a bad dude. Like, the way he treated the beast and Bell and had all the messed up things he did, and he was like, in Chain of, or no, not Chain of Memories, 358, he was like, thank you. I don't want any mercy given to anyone. We need to get rid of people if they're weak. And it's like, now he's good. 
So, what happened? Like, why is he now good again? Like, did he repent? And if he is, why? Because we haven't seen him talk yet. Or, uh, Alias. So, you think you can bring Roxas back? Uh-oh. Handsome! Uh-oh, man. Samness. Uh, Roxas oh, to the never max, have existed dude. In what? The first place. What you seek is impossible. Roxas does exist. His heart's inside my heart. And in the unlikely event you did manage to separate the two, where is it you think you can put his heart? Well, Roxas used to live in the other Twilight Town, right? So, I'm just gonna put him back there. Do you even realize what you are saying? The other Twilight Town is just Data. A heart can live anywhere, even inside Data. I mean, I there guess. There are hearts all around us. It's only a body, so it's hmm. like... Huh? Handsome and Zemnis used to be part of the same person, right? Yeah. But yeah. look, now they exist separately just fine. Well, mm. that's because of time they travel, can do it, though. Then I don't see any reason why you and Roxas can't find a way. Oh, yeah, but that's... Di yeah. No, their situation is different. Their situation is different, though. That's because it was because of time travel. That's why. In that case, by all means. And they're... Okay, I love that. They're actually agreeing with Goofy. Goofy said something actually kind of making sense to a degree, and they're agreeing with Goofy. I love that. Nothing would please us more than Roxas's return, of course. You wish? He'll never answer to you again. Dude, my hands are sweating. Still so yeah. blind. A nobody is what's left behind. When one gives his heart to darkness. Darkness. There is only one way to bring Roxas back, which is for you to give your heart up as well. Man, voice Sora, actor for Zemnis, dude. Like, have you finally so good. decided to call so good. on the darkness? Uh oh, what's happening? What? What's happening? Go on then. The shadows are never out of reach. <sighs> Now, set your heart free. Uh oh. Wait! Sora! Okay, time to go in. Hey. It's not darkness. Not if it helps him. That would still be darkness, technically. You're saying it's not darkness if it helps people? That's some biased logic because that would still be darkness. Now, I know what he means by it, but it's still like. The way he said it made it seem biased. But dang it, man! The, the shadows of you know, Twilight Town and the sun setting, it's like. I can't take that, dude. I just cannot take that. It's too nice. It's way too nice, man. I can't. Let me get R Star Cannon. Hey, going in with a combo team attack, dude. Hey. Man, I love this game so much. This game definitely has gripes. It does. I said this before. I keep saying it. I, I, I just can't help it. It has gripes, but, like, there are so, so many good things and amazing things. Just insanely amazing things about this game that it's like... I don't know. I don't know. And the video will be coming after this Let's Play series is over, where I state all of my gripes first. All of the all the complaints I have about, all the complaints I have about the game. I'll state first before I ever make any good video. Or no, no, wait, wait. It's like this, right? After this Let's Play series is over, I'm gonna make a video or videos talking about all the negative things I feel about the game. Then after that, I'm gonna make a bunch of videos talking about all the amazing things I love about the game. I want to get all the negatives out of the way, basically, before I get over to the positives, basically. Yo, Sora. 
Mm-hmm. Herc said... He said, with all my heart. Okay, then all my heart it is. I'm getting Roxas out. Are you with me? Donald? Goofy? <laughs> you bet <laughs> you! Okay, okay. I don't know what Ansem and Xemnas want, but I think we better tell the others to watch out. <laughs> okay then. Let's head back to town. Hmm. Okay, let's go. Hey. Back to Twilight Town. Or back to the main town. You know, technically, you know, Twilight Town is the world itself, but you know, back to the main area of the town, I mean. Again, I don't really see myself using this too much. Like, the flow motion? It's okay. It's okay. It's not amazing, but you know. It's like there are so many other ways you can go about traversing and fighting in the game. It's like. I hardly well, I ever see myself really using it, here. so it's like, oh yeah, wait, let me get that. Hey, I I've seen it lucky also. emblem. Yeah. Wait. Oh, dupes. Oops. There we go. Cheese. screens like and if there are any loading screens it's so minimal and so very few man the power of the ps4 pro man it's crazy well bless Whoa. my bagpipes it was you laddies who rescued my <laughs> chef and they changed the voice actor huh? either that Wait, or it's the same one and you kind of change cream and hollow bastion that's right but Uncle Scrooge here is what you might call a world traveler. Cool. <laughs> How are you, Uncle Scrooge? Oh, hello, Sora. You're looking hale and hearty. I heard you were on another grand adventure with these two. I hope Donald isn't making a menace of himself. Now, one thing I do wish is that they actually so took the Uncle voice Scrooge. actor from the reboot of DuckTales and had his clothes from the reboot oh, in Kingdom Hearts right, 3. That would have right. been crazy. I would have loved that. The chef of me bistro here wanted to show you his appreciation. So, he baked this for you. Hmm. What is it? Wow! Cake! Hey, it looks good. Hmm? The whole cake? It's for us? Huh? I mean, uh, settle down. Uh, the chef wants you to know it's not a cake, but a tart of fruit. He does? A tart of fruit? Why keep it under my hat? May I introduce Little Chef? Oh, oh it's you! Uncle Scrooge, you open the bistro and try on town! Because why not, hey? It all started a little while ago when I was enjoying one of the best meals of my life. And when I asked to speak to the chef, I met this wee genius. As it turns out, he wanted to expand his culinary horizons. So I thought, that's an opportunity. And I financed the whole operation. Okay, hey, you know, making the money, entrepreneuring, yo. Ooh. I mean, granted, I'm not really sure how entrepreneuring works. I think he wants to cook really some more works, for but... you. Fetch some ingredients. I'm Especially assuming it's kind of something unusual. like that, you know, financing That'll be fun. things and making money like a scavenger hunt. by investing. And the more the better. The mark of a truly great chef is creating masterpieces out of anything. You can start right here in town. 
We'll do anything to try more of Little Chef's food. I love that. I that love it. Tart, sure, it looks scrumptiously delicious. Yeah, so eat okay. it. Okay, the ingredient hunt is on. Okay, so now we have to go find the ingredients we need for the little chef, otherwise known as Remy. So let's go find them. Let's see. They're scattered, you know, all around the town. So let's see. Inside of these small little boxes, little inside of like baskets, you know. We better keep an eye out. I know. Let me grab this also. One. Thankfully, I played the game before, so you know. I should have a somewhat easier time finding them compared to before, where it took me forever to find them all, so... <sighs> Let's see here. Oops. I guess skateboarding is passe now. I, I guess so, dude. No more skateboards. It's crazy. I'm well, you. Hungry. <laughs> oh, same Goofy. I have not eaten anything yet. So, I'm actually kind of hungry myself. Let's see if there's more. See up here. I found a hidden Mickey. Let me take a picture. Got it. Should be some more somewhere. Let me see. Here. Nope. Yeah. Okay. Just imagine the yummy stuff little chef will whip up with this. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Okay, and one more. Let's see yeah. if I can find that last ah. one. Let me break that. I said break this. Yeah. Oh, wait, dude. Hey, nice breaking moves. it down, oh, hey! God. Sora, good stuff, man. Let's see here. I found it. Hey, boss. Uh, Done with the posters. Uh -huh. Your boss? Hey! Good work, kids. You guys work for Uncle Scrooge here at the bistro? Um, do we? He gave us a short job putting up these special posters. Mr. McDuck's hosting an open-air film no, festival I, in the courtyard. I love it! I cool, love huh? it! I love how they do this. You know, uh -huh. callbacks to, you know, oh, old, old Disney works. It's Hold like... Phone up to the poster. And we got QR codes! Kay. Man, no, no. Our AR codes, QR codes, it, no. There, you've just downloaded a promo game for the film. We got apps. You can try it later. We have apps. We have smartphones. Of course, we have selfies. Bloody. Provide a bit of entertainment. We have Instagram. And then give folks a nice, cozy place to relax. Like my bistro here. They'll all be happy and hungry and eager to spend their money. <laughs> Yo, it's not really evil. It's more just like you know they want your product. They want to sell it or buy it. Or she sure is canny. I always wondered how he keeps customers coming into his businesses over and over by selling oh, things yeah. that they I'm want no business to guy, buy. Basically, but I sure you know? wouldn't want to be one of Uncle Scrooge's competitors. Sure things <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> oh. oh, right. I need to warn you guys. Why? Well. Those creepy crawly things might come back for more. So stay on your toes. Sure. But don't we have you guys to take care of them for us? Yeah, but we may not always be around, you so have to be leave on again? your guard. Mm hmm. Now, why we'll exactly do you have to leave? Back. It's like. When are you gonna slow what? down? Sorry. Just do me a favor. Well, what In is it? In terms of what we know don't right now, why do you have to leave right now? I know it's how like, Roxas feels. To be lost. Really, you just but have Donald to wait. Goofy? Wait Kyrie until you get the information about the data inside of your heart from hearts. Enzo and Chippendale. So I don't get why you have to leave, but it's like. So, 
I was hoping the three of you would do the same and wish for Roxas. What? That's it? <laughs> That's no favor. We'll all wish. I'm wishing. Yeah. Me and Pence, too. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, it's panning out. Uh-oh, what's happening? What's happening? And Zigbar. Aren't you making it a little too obvious? We were instructed to guide him. Yes, just look at them. They wouldn't get far if we did not spell it out. Huh. Fair enough. But let's not forget how many times Sora still managed to rain on our parade. If he wavers from the path we lay, we destroy him. But in that case, we'll have to find ourselves another vessel. That is why we never have just one iron in the fire. And we got Giant's Land, a classic kingdom game you could play on the gummy phone. And again, I'm not going to play classic. And we got Shooting Star, a keyblade with an emphasis on magic. Form changes are double arrow guns and magic launcher. Dude, no. We equipping that right now, and technically, in this world, we are all done. So, basically, before I keep going, let me go and go in here. Let's change this up. Or, I actually kind of want to keep this in here, so let's change it up to Shooting Star here. And as we can see here, we now have Shooting Star, the main keyblade that they kept showing off in multiple upon multiple upon multiple trailers. We now have it, and it looks amazing. But anyway, guys, in terms of this Let's Play for the Part 4 Let's Play of Kingdom Hearts 3, I am going to go end it here. So far, we got a bunch done. We're about to go to the next big world. We found out more about the data, about Roxas, about how we need to bring him back. Basically, Yento and Chippendale, they're researching the data. We now see Ansem, Seeker of Darkness, and Zemnis seeing how they kind of want Sora to be another vessel. But if that doesn't work out, they got more options, and we just have to keep playing and see. But in terms of this Let's Play, I'm going to end it here, guys. This is Shark Tank. Have a great, awesome, and merry day. See you all in, I guess, part five. So, yeah, have a great day, guys. Peace.